Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. We are on the topic about watches, so I actually want to show you how a real Omega looks like. Not the Omega Swatch Omega collaboration, but actually a Seamaster 300, which I just bought. And uh, the quality, the finish of this watch, they're simply incredible. You know, the, the, this, is, this is truly a Swiss made watch, which I want to walk you through first as unboxing. So there are some uh, text on the side, how many kilos this package is, like 1.8 kilos. What the um, color of the box is, is beige. Um, you know, the, the number, the you know, fact that it's made by Omega. Um, then we have the box. I will open it from here. I just got it. So you're going to be the first to actually see the watch. So you open it from here. This is some paperwork, which got, um, I got with, um, you know, by ordering the watch. So here is the original box of how an Omega looks like. And this is a real Omega, you know, the one that you buy for special occasions in life that you want to remember. And one of these occasions was me actually graduating from my university, graduated the University of Cambridge. So I actually made myself a really nice gift. So I want to open it with you now, just throwing the box. So here you go. This is a real Omega unboxing. It's a Seamaster 300. Price tag of around 5,000 euros. There you go. Just put it here. This is the actual box. So there are some operating instructions that Omega sends you with every single watch. So, you know, it's an amazing instruction guide. You know, most people don't check it, but I would actually recommend because automatic watches, they have a special um, mechanic inside. So you need to be aware of how to use the watch and what not to do with it, right? That's more important. And you have some cards. This is the international warranty of Omega, some pictograms and master chronometer uh, KPIs. So basically they, with every single watch, they send you a card where you can see how accurate the watch was because they measure every single unit. So they would actually show you for your specific watch, how the measurements worked and how accurate it is, obviously within the benchmarks for quality. So, um, you know, this is the premiumness of how Omega does things and it has a very nice finish and touch. I mean, for a watch which costs 5,000 euros and more, um, it's actually what you would expect, I guess. So here is the box, I'll just take it out. It's a wooden box of Omega. It's a really, really beautiful one. So here you go. You can see there is a little bit of plastic here. It's completely new. It's made out of special wood. So I'm just open it now. This is how the Seamaster 300 looks like, right? You have the Omega logo on top and you have the watch here. So I'm gonna take out the watch. I wanna show you what a real Omega looks like. So this is the Seamaster 300. It's, uh, it's with the rubber, rubber um, strip. It's a, it's a really beautiful watch, so it has an amazing finish, by the way. Um, it's really, truly gorgeous. And you have this clicking, obviously. It's a really nice sound, by the way. I mean, it shows you the quality of the watch. We're talking about a really premium Swiss watch. It's an Omega Seamaster 300. I would say this is more famous than the uh, Speedmaster. Um, I think this is one of probably the most popular watch that Omega has done now. So it com comes in this box and you have, you know, obviously the finishing here, really, really premium. Inside, can't see it probably in the video, but it's truly good quality. Every single detail you can see, you can see that here, it's a little bit of text probably. Um, it says that there is a master chronometer and it's 300 meters um, water resistant. Um, if you take it out, you would actually be able to see the whole technical function of the automatic watch here. So I'm gonna show you in a second. Here you go, the automatic movement. Look at this beauty. And you can see inside the serial number of the watch. So Omega is known to be able to 
make one of the best automatic movements in the world. And I can truly say that this is, I mean, it's not only working well, it looks, it looks really, really good. So I'm um, truly an amazing watch, right? So can only recommend it. Um, if I put the watch inside, um, next in the box, you have, you know, a small little um, compartment where there is a little box. Um, there's a little um, cover that you can use um, wet to actually travel with, and uh, it's a beautiful one. Um, and then this is it. Um, this is the box. Please check out my other video where I'm going to show you a comparison between this Seamaster 300 and the Swatch, the Omega Swatch collaboration. Um, it's a really, really interesting one. So I'm going to link it at the end of this video. So make sure you watch it. Um, and please subscribe if you want to see more of these videos. Um, I'm going to be really, really happy if you subscribe so you can support the channel. Thank you.